Welcome back to the Early News Show. And tomorrow in the Topeka area, well, it is in the Topeka area because it is in Topeka, the Grand Theater, Tina Turner will be appearing. But with Tina, a local group known as the Scat Band. And it's good to have you all with us. Thank well, you. Thank you, Bill. I don't think thank I've you. ever seen such a full house here before. I'll start with you, Dan Blackwood, who's seated closest to me. Dan, why don't you go down the line and introduce the Scat Band? Okay. I play bass in the group. Next to me is Nancy Angleton on keyboards and vocals. Seated next to her is Charles Harrison, plays keyboards and vocals. Then Hyson Taylor. Right. I play vocals. drums. <laughs> and Rick next Barron to him, here. Rick Barron, guitar and vocals. Indeed, and we want to mention that uh, we couldn't get the group to perform today because Rick's getting his arm repaired for tomorrow night. All right. He'll be ready to go, though. Indeed. Now, this is a big thing for Topeka. Tina Turner, of course, is known the world over and coming to Topeka tomorrow night. What are you guys going to do to set up the stage for all this? Well, we have a local group, Alchemy, is, is uh, using their sound and lights for the concert, and uh, it's going to be a... We're, we're really excited about it. It'll be a, a regular concert for Topeka. It's something that Topeka is not used to having, and we hope that uh, it, it will go well enough that we can do some more things here at the Grand Theater. Tell me a little bit about the background of the Scat Band. Um, scat Band pretty much got started with Charles and I and Rick over here. Um, in the paper, it was called a composer's workshop. I guess that's a pretty formal title for it, but it was just the three of us um, plunking out original tunes with each other, playing me melodies, working out harmonies, mm -hmm. that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. And then um, High Song was out of town at the time. He came back into town. Um, we snatched him up, and then we were playing a gig at a club downtown, and Dan will sat in and, and scat band will thereafter it was the lost. Is <laughs> the rest is history. How long have y'all been together then? Going on two years now. Is it two years? All of us together just one year. We had our us. anniversary about a month ago. Okay. Mm -hmm. Charles, what, how would you describe the sound scat band puts out, Charles? Eclectic. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a lot of different, a uh, lot of different influences, uh -huh. a lot of different types of people in the band, mm -hmm. as you can see, different shapes and colors, <laughs> sexes. So I, I don't know. Jazz is a big influence. Mm -hmm. Funk, Latin, no reggae, no reggae, and a little bit of rock and roll too. Yeah. yeah. It's now, only rock and roll. now being, you know, being the backbone for a group like this. What is your background and My uh, background? type of music that you enjoyed the best and how do you fit into the scat band? Well, I've always um, made it a point to uh, keep my approach wide open. I like to play reggae music. I like rock and roll. I played in blues bands. Mm -hmm. you know, just, I like it all. Any, anything with rhythm, pretty much my bag, as it were. There you go. Mm -hmm. Now, Rick, I've got the ultimate question for you because we were talking about your arm. This is the ultimate. Now, how can you get tendonitis playing guitar? I want to know the answer to this. Well, Bill, to tell you the truth, I'm not sure how you can either, but I, I guess uh, it was uh, the circumstances were right. I used my wrist a lot, get pretty physical with the guitar, trying to do a good job. Yeah. And it happened to be cold, and I think I just overworked it and just a little bit too much of a strain for it. And uh, next thing you know it, uh, Tendonitis is what I have, and uh, so I, but it's going to turn out okay, and everything's going to work out right. It just took a little time to heal up, so I'm real fortunate about how it's been working out. Doctor says that you're capable of playing tomorrow. Yeah, right? doctor said I went to an orthopedist yesterday, and he said it was fine. Uh, I mean, well, he said it was sore that I should uh, take it easy, but it was okay to play guitar. He knew of our band and the performance that we had to do on Friday to go ahead and do it, and then uh, to look back on him early Monday, and he would help me to heal it up a little bit better. <laughs> okay. Dan, I'm glad that Rick's arm is better and the scat band will be ready to go tomorrow night with Tina Turner. And I want to ask you something real quickly. Is he limited how many chords he can play now? Uh, no. Not me. He be jamming. <laughs> <night>. be jamming. <laughs> <laughs> he can play every chord there is. <laughs> That's right. That should be a very fun concert. What time is it all getting underway tomorrow? The first show is at 7.30. Mm -hmm. The second show is at 10.30. We will play first and then Tina Turner will come on and do her show. And the tickets are available at Mother Earth so they can be gotten real quickly right. here in town. Right, right. and they're, they're going fairly rapidly. That's All right. right. Thank you, Scat Band, for being with us. Thank Have a good time well. tomorrow night. Uh, I won't say break a leg because <laughs> Rick might do that. We don't want him to <laughs> two cast tomorrow night for the Tina Turner concert. I want to mention that uh, Tina will be here with us tomorrow, so that should be interesting, All too. Right. We'll be back. Stay with us.